this following video, if you are struggling to choose between a Boer Bull, also known as the South African Mastiff and the Dog de Bordeaux, also known as the French Mastiff, we have compiled all the detailed information you need to know to help you make the best choice. So let's begin the fight. Intimidation Factor An adult male Boer Bull stands at a height of 24 to 28 inches at the withers, and weighs between 70 to 90 kilograms. They are large, muscular and stocky dogs with powerful jaws and squared off muzzle. This South African Mastiff is a tough breed, bred for guarding the homestead in hard African conditions. Whereas an adult male French Mastiff stands at a height of 23 to 27 inches at the withers, and weighs between 50 to 70 kilograms. They are stocky and athletic build, with a deep, broad chest. This dog has a massive head with lots of wrinkles and quite serious and ferocious expression. However, in terms of intimidation, the French Mastiff appears to be more intimidating as compared to a Boer Bull. So one point to French Mastiff. Boer Bull 0 French Mastiff 1. Powerful and loudest bark. Let's hear it first and we'll decide accordingly. <laughs> In our opinion the Boer Bull has a powerful bark. So one point to Boer Bull. Boer Bull 1 French Mastiff 1. Bite force. Among the two, the Boer Bull pressure bite topped 640 psi while that of the French Mastiff measured 556 psi. So one point to Boer Bull. Boer Bull 2 French Mastiff 1. Temperament. The Boer Bull has a reputation of being an intelligent noble dog with aggressive and protective temperament. They can be a dangerous breed if not controlled and raised right. They need a strong-willed owner whom they can respect, otherwise they can be dominating and very territorial. Whereas the French Mastiff may also be imposing to look at, but they are gentle giants with even temper and docile nature as compared to a Boer Bull. So one point to French Mastiff. Boer Bull 2 French Mastiff 2 Lifespan The average life expectancy of a Boer Bull is in between 10 to 12 years and that of a French Mastiff is in between 5 to 8 years. So with longer lifespan, 1 point to Boer Bull. Boer Bull 3 French Mastiff 2 Exercise and Energy Levels Both the dogs are high-maintenance dogs in the exercise department Department, and ideally need to be taken out for a walk, a minimum of twice a day for a good hour each time. However, in terms of energy levels, a Boer Bull has a slight edge over the French Mastiff. So one point to Boer Bull. Boer Bull 4 French Mastiff 2. Friendly with kids. Both the breeds are known to be good around children's, more especially if they are well bred, even tempered dogs. However, they are not recommended for toddlers because of their great size. So one point to both. Boer Bull 5 French Mastiff 3. Temperament with other dogs and pets. Both the dogs can show aggression towards other dogs and pets which is why it's important they be introduced to each other slowly and carefully to make sure things go smoothly. So one point to both. Boer Bull 6 French Mastiff 4. Powerful guard dog. In our opinion. A Boer Bull is extremely ferocious and a powerful guard dog as compared to the French Mastiff. So one point to Boer Bull. Boer Bull 7 French Mastiff 4. So the winner between the two large guard dogs is the South African Mastiff, Boer Bull. 